take a look at conditions. Obviously, the days are getting a little shorter. That sun is getting lower on the horizon earlier, and that's a look up along the north coast. Wow, I'll tell you what, what a day we had. Beautiful local weather, but of course, we had a fire here locally. Statewide fire weather concerns due to this offshore push. It is going to weaken a little bit. We'll talk about that. Take a look at this picture. This is called a MODIS satellite. It's a high resolution satellite. Satellite It's a polar orbiter, so we get a little better view of this. Now, this is what happened at 10 o'clock last night. Those Northern California winds 50 to 60 miles per hour, and they were going this morning as well. This picture taken at about 11 o'clock local time, and you can see all that smoke blowing across the North Bay area a little bit further to the north as well. Massive, just massive when you look at that much smoke across Northern California. This is the 101 San Luis Obispo right now. Santa Maria 72 or 75 in San Luis and 86 in Paso Robles. Lompoc 71 at 72 degrees in Santa Barbara. Winds about 15 miles per hour onshore in Santa Maria and San Luis. Elsewhere, the winds are a little less than that, with the exception being Lompoc West at 16 miles per hour. When we got up and got going today, you might see that there was a red flag warning and a wind advisory locally. That wind advisory really was only for this thin little sliver along eastern San Luis Obispo County where bordered Kern. Elsewhere, we really didn't see much of the wave stronger winds. Well, that Pozo area was one of the places where the winds did exceed 20 miles per hour, but one of the few places locally, actually. Paso Robles back up into the mid 80s tomorrow. Easterly winds early will turn out of the southwest in the afternoon and likely stay under about 15 miles per hour. San Luis Obispo temperatures back up into the lower 80s after starting in the 50s. Southeast winds early turning westerly in the afternoon. A bit of a breeze of it about 10 to 15 miles per hour. Santa Maria back up into the mid 70s to about 80 degrees at noon and one o'clock with temperatures fading in the afternoon behind that westerly wind of 10 to 15. So we've got this ridge of high pressure building in behind this trough that actually brought snow to Denver and to Minnesota and places like that really cool across the central section of the country. But for us, the offshore flow sinks, compresses, dries out the air. Less of an impact, but still around a bit tomorrow. As you can see in the seven day forecast bottom of your screen, we do lose some in the way of heat on Wednesday to be exchanged for stronger northwest winds. We still have the fire weather warning in place for low relative humidities and the potential for some breezy conditions, but not really particularly hot. We're actually under the criteria for most of these red flag warnings, but with fires going in Northern California, you can see why they would still have them there. This is the real concerning number. This dew point of 17 up in Paso Robles. That is really, really dry air up in North County. Again, some of the relative humidity readings are under 10% right now. 15 is a critical number. When fuels get going at about 15% or lower relative humidity, they really flash quickly. Temperatures a little warmer at much of the coast, a little cooler in the interior. Again, we're watching some breeze up in eastern San Luis Obispo County. That will abate a bit tonight. The area to watch after that is here across central and southern Santa Barbara County as we get into tomorrow afternoon. So again, not much going on in the morning, but take a look at some of the winds here across southern Santa Barbara County in the afternoon. Some southerly winds or westerly winds up to about 20 miles per hour. Locally breezy, other Otherwise, uh, then we'll see those winds shifting a little bit offshore at times. This big trough digging in for Wednesday and Thursday will crank up first the southwesterly winds, but ultimately they become a little more westerly. This is the forecast for Tuesday. You can see some of those daytime highs. 82 San Luis, 86 Paso Robles, 81 Santa Barbara, Santa Inez Valley temperatures, low 80s. Five cities temperatures, upper 70s. North Coast temperatures tomorrow, low to mid 70s. Extended forecast, again, the trend is down a little bit, a little more marine layer as we get into Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Stay right there. We're back after this.